carry the blanket. Hey, I can get carpet for you. Or we could do something else. Well, here's your blanket. It's Friday! Yes, welcome to another episode of The Fiend Zone here on Horror Fiend TV. Now, in case you haven't been watching, we have been doing sharks this month. Mr. Criston! Mr. Criston! How about this belt? Shave off that dreadful mustache. England expects every man to do his duty. You may fire when ready, Goodly. Damn the torpedoes! Full speed ahead! This will be our final hour. Oh, shit. <laughs> hey, Bly, someone pop your balloon? No problem. No problem. One of the greatest sequels to a horror movie ever, but could it be possibly better than the original? Now... I know what most of you think. Are you crazy? Are you talking down to Jaws? No. I'm just going to tell you why I think Jaws 2 is possibly better than Jaws 1. Yes, we got the returning Roy Scheider playing Chief Brody and Lauren Gary returning as Ellen Brody. In Jaws 2, yes, we get Chief Brody. Brody, who is still recovering from the events of the Jaws film. A couple years later, he believes things are better than they were before, yes. And lo and behold, it comes back a more deadlier shark than the original. And I'll tell you why. For us shark fans, what's the one thing that we want in shark films? A kill count. Now, in this film... We had six confirmed shark deaths, well, excluding this one. Terry! However, in Jaws 2, there's one thing that's kind of ignored, the storyline, because we have Chief Brody, who has PTSD from the events of the original film, and once he begins to find clues about these accidents that are happening and the possibility of another shark being out there, especially after big orca that was surfaced on the on the beach with that massive bite wound he starts believing there is something out there now chief who remember in the original he fell a bit of an outcast and this one he feels more isolated because his wife works for the council she works for Len, who is an a-hole but he feels more secluded than ever and the ptsd shows in certain clips remember that one clip where he's basically in his office with the needle bullets i mean he is suffering tremendously and once the shark begins to attack we get another scene where chief brody is on the beach thinks he sees a shark shot in the water pulls out his gun and starts shooting now Prior to this, he was literally trying to, once again, convince the mayor there's another shark possibly out there. So he sits with the council, shows them the picture that they found of the diver who was basically had to swim up because he saw a shark, almost got attacked. And they found the camera and showed the footage of the shark eye 
Council refused to believe him. They fired him. They fired Chief Brody, who begins going on a drinking binge and, yes, once again, goes into depression. And what better way to get Chief out of depression? Well, this. Yes, now Chief Brody kicks the depression to the side and goes to save his two sons, Mike and Sean. Now, we might not get the great catchphrase at the end of this film like the original, but Jaws 2 was more exciting than the original. I'm just saying it's my opinion. What is your opinion? Do you believe that the original is still better than Jaws 2 or... You fall on my side a little bit that Jaws 2 potentially could be better than the original. More kills, better storyline, and more time in the water. Well, not just three people on the boat, a variety of people. And good scenes. The acting, I think, was a little better than this one. But Chief Brody once again saves the day. And, well, I really do like this film. And the fact that you have foreshadowing. With that power cable. I love that. Any movie that has foreshadowing where you think of something, eh, I don't know why they're showing it, but when it comes down later in the film, I love it. So, what do you think of? Jaws 2, am I right? Am I wrong? Hey, we all have opinions, but this is one discussion that you can either go on either side. You're not really wrong, but what do you feel? Do you think I'm wrong? Let me know in the comments below. Yes, it is Friday. Please, please, please enjoy your weekend. Yes, this is JR for the Fiend Zone. Hit that like, subscribe, continue to share us, and thank you for your continual support. Enjoy yourself. Peace.